All right, thanks, Jared. Yeah, we're out here at Tahazuka Park. All week long, it's tuned in for Kids Week as we make our way towards Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. We have the telethon on Cat 103, partnering up with our radio partners there over at uh, iHeartRadio. I'm right here with Peter Rigg. I almost said this morning. I don't do the morning show anymore. This evening, beautiful night out here. He loves playing soccer, Elkhorn Soccer Club. Now, about when he was three years old, diagnosed with IBD and ulcerative colitis. And with that, you have a very restrictive diet. But he's been in remission, thanks to Children's Hospital, for about the last year. And he's really pumped to tell you about his favorite foods. I told him to pick three, and he's he's got three, probably more. So now that you have a, uh, a less restrictive diet and you can eat a little more, what do you just chow down on? Pizza, spaghetti, and toast. Something as simple. Garlic toast, stuff like that? Yeah. Awesome, like perfect. Toast and and it likes Italian food. That's perfect. Thanks a lot, Peter. I'll let you go back and play with your friends. I know I'm interrupting soccer here. But yeah, uh, thanks to everyone at Children's uh, Hospital. He's able to do stuff like that as well. We're going to be highlighting kids all week long that have benefited and are able to just come out and hang with their friends because of Children's Hospital, guys. Bread and carbs. Peter's got it right. Yeah, I missed ice cream. That's the only thing I missed. Ice out cream. Of. He's got yeah. things figured out. He certainly does. Thanks, Rusty. Well, if I